Um, I'm concerned here that this is a, a fail policy moment for uh, what we're trying to do with NVIDIA by keeping NVIDIA chips from uh, China, essentially. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we're seeing uh, necessity be the mother of invention. We're seeing China, top, top two leading companies, Huawei and Baidu, yep. developing their own chips to compete with NVIDIA and AMD chips. Uh, I, I think, I, I don't know if the answer is open up the market and let them buy NVIDIA chips, but we are compelling them to create NVIDIA and AMD competitors. Right. I'm not sure if that's a great policy outcome. The point you're making is that the Chinese have already demonstrated that they are, in terms of this technology, at a minimum a near peer, if not a peer. And I think the, the, the moment that that became abundantly clear was with DeepSeek about a year ago now when they were able to develop a frontier model that was very competitive and open sourced, by the way, with all of the restrictions in place around the hardware. And to your point that, that uh, the restrictions were kind of the mother of, of invention, they couldn't get the most efficient hardware. So what did they do? They figured out a way to create a competitive model with even higher efficiency so that the hardware kind of wasn't the bottleneck at yeah. that point didn't actually it, solve it, the it problem. It feels good, but then you have to confront this reality yeah. that, that they have a tremendous amount of momentum in terms of the development of new technology 